all right guys so it's been a while since we've done a i guess you, what you call it a pop it video so this is the one with the led screen and basically we're gonna see how much the batteries have drained in stage mode so i haven't played with this in a minute honestly i should see if there are even any batteries in this or did i take them out because i was smart and didn't want anything to sort of go bad and that have a waste of batteries i think i was smart <laughs> ish smart ish so since since we have discovered that this baby is empty, well, not baby, bear, this berry is empty, I'm gonna go ahead and unscrew the back. Oh yeah. Alright, so this is a practice that I've started to do for myself, so whenever I'm not using my poppet, I take the batteries up. Where did I put the back? Okay, found it. Cool. Can you guys see? I'm trying my best here with the injured phalanges. Alright. Let's go ahead and turn this baby on. Ouch. Also, this is all in real time. So it's taken me three and a half minutes, two and a half minutes to get to level 10. Oof. I have no idea what that means. And this is when you pass it to somebody else. So it does tell you what level you're on when you're in multiplayer mode. And by the time the other person goes, then it's automatically on to the next level. So I would just say this for this one specifically, it would be a two player mode. Because it seems to be counting the levels between two players. Team 
Whoa, I have no idea what that. Um, so I'm not sure exactly what all the modes are. Um, my siblings don't have the poppets with the LED screen, so I guess we'll figure that out in the next video. Um, but as of right now, thank you guys so much for watching this video on this poppet. I'm gonna go ahead and take. Actually, I might do another video tomorrow for you guys, but uh, yeah, so far so good. It's a neat little game. Definitely helps with uh, any emotional dysregulation anyone might have. Um, helps with coping, but the bubbles are loud no matter what is all I gotta say. So yeah. Also, don't mind the color on my gauze because I feel like some of you might be questioning what that is. Um, I got a cuticle infection and that's just healing fluid that's being soaked up by the gauze. And I flipped it around so I don't have to change my gauze anytime soon. It's just healing fluid. That's what that yellow stuff is. It's just a copious amount of healing fluid. But yeah. So I think I am going to take the batteries out. I have a couple of other videos to do. And yeah. Oof. And I don't want to forget the batteries in this poppet because then they die. So, just so you know, the ones where you have to screw it on, those are the poppet games that drain the batteries no matter if you use it or not. So, just be aware of that. Parents, guardians, older siblings, anyone in charge of a child that has a poppet game. The batteries will be drained if you just keep them in here and your child's not using their poppet push fidget toy game thing. Yeah. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. It feels good to be doing more poppet videos again and yeah. Hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.